Good afternoon. My name is Jessica Kennedy. This video is for discussion for week one for doctoral research in History 701 Historical Professions. Through the eyes of Hollywood, organized crime and the influence on American society. As far back as I can remember, I've always wanted to be a gangster. To me, being a gangster was better than being President of the United States. These words set the mood for Martin Scorsese's 1990 film, Goodfellas. Famous lines like these are easily remembered from mafia-themed movies. Films like Little Caesar in 1931 and The Godfather in 1974 and many more along with television shows like The Sopranos are examples of gangster genre that has changed the American perception of the true mafia. Americans' fascinations for all things gangster is due in part to Hollywood's glorification of the mob, uh, the mafia lifestyle with its infamous fictional and non-fictional gangsters and the romanticized depiction of the true nature of the mafia have produced generational interest in organized crime. Titles like Mafia, La Cosa Nostra, and Family give a decidedly familiar image in most minds. But the question is, did the influence of Hollywood and other media types shape the American dream perception by the becoming powerful at doing whatever means necessary while simultaneously gilding the truth of organized crime in the United States? Hundreds of movies, television shows, music lyrics, art, and clothing designs have all been influenced by the gl glamorified mafia story. Images like Al Pacino and Scarface, the iconic Godfather puppet, and the perception of leadership that promoted loyalty among everything else, and the consequences for disloyalty within this mafia lifestyle. This more than often false lifestyle does not represent the true nature of the real mafia. Gambling, pornography, prostitution, drugs, extortion, racketeering are just a few examples of the true actions within the family member's conduct. And it must be said that the mafia or organized crime is still very active today. It is not just the 1920s, the 40s, or the 70s event, but even the Mafia doesn't admit to the Mafia being real. The study will serve as an investigation as into how Hollywood and other media outlets molded society's views by romanticizing family loyalty over the horrendous acts of the involved criminal members. This will also utilize law enforcement data, political decision-making, and entertainment factions as it appears to organized crimes and how society perceives and has embraced crime. Although this study will rely mainly on documentaries, biographical and archival methods, criminal data will also be used to show the link between Hollywood and societies the more can't see the forest or the trees kind of issues, the mentality about the mafia. Findings will show that through the actions of authors, screenwriters, directors, and other entertainment areas, the mafia has been transformed into a multicultural sensation. Thank you.